Hey everyone! Today I'm just going to be filming a very quick video. I got a package in the mail and it is a bunch of pacifiers and an outfit for a new baby you guys don't know about. It was actually a big surprise to me and I have another baby that was a big surprise coming tomorrow. So I should have a box opening uploaded tomorrow for you guys but um, there is a chance that that baby will arrive um, on Friday. Yeah, had to think of what day it was. Anyway, let's get into this package opening. Um, it says freebie on it, so this must be an extra, which would be so nice. Let's see. Oh, these are so cute. Oh my goodness. I'm going to bring them up this, to the camera for you guys. Kind of in a hurry because I still need to cook dinner. And my packages always arrive really late. Those are so stinking cute. I've never seen these before. They're so cute. I know who those are going to be for. I have a baby in mind. All right. Oh, and there's a card in here. It says, thank you. And it has some little birds. It says, thank you so much. Enjoy your goodies, Willow. That's very sweet of her to include a card. All right. The ribbon just came right off that. This is the outfit. very sweet it is a little dragonfly outfit here's the hat the sleeper and hat set here's the print on the sleeper okay now you guys see this big package of pacifiers i have never bought so many pacifiers but these were such a good deal there was no way i could pass them up um this is a lot of 16 i think and this is a lot of nine all right let's look at the bigger bag first Okay, so we have this nook, which I had never seen before. Thought it was really cute. Then we have this one. Oh, and that one's like really small. Like, I don't know if you guys can see that, but it looks Almost like a premium pacifier. Hmm. Never had one of those before. And we have this nook. Never seen. I don't think I've seen most of these pacifiers that are in these lots. Cute. I don't know if I'm going to keep this one. I might send it in like some happy mail to someone because I don't know. I don't like that one too much, but still cute. And then this one. And this is just a solid colored nook pacifier. This one, which looks like it must be a vintage pacifier because it has, um, oh, what would you call that? I don't remember what it's called. But it's not silicone. We have this one. It's kind of like a camo, I guess. Not a fan of camo, so that's another one that I will probably, probably send to a friend. 
Here's another one. This is taking longer than expected <laughs> because I have so many pacifiers to show. This one is a, I'm trying to find the name, Diphrex, I think. So this is an international pacifier. I'm not exactly sure where these are from, but they're not from the US. I do have one other of these, a little bit of a different style. I think they're very interesting. So this is the second one I've had of that brand. And then we have this one with the butterflies which I really like. This one. Um, this one, I'm not sure what brand it is, but it says Cutie Pie on it. This one, I believe this is a parent's choice pacifier. I've never seen this particular one. Oh no, it's a Dr. Brown's. Okay. Could barely see it. But it looks almost like a parent's choice style. So that's why I thought it was. Um, this one is really cute. That's probably my favorite out of this lot. I don't know why the camera's not focusing this time. There we go. That took a really long time to focus. Oh my goodness, but it is so cute. It has little flowers on it, and I think that's supposed to be a lily pad. It's adorable. All right, and the last one from, wait a minute. Is there two of those in here? Yeah. Okay, so there was two of these ones in there, which I did not know that. I guess I didn't notice it in the picture. All right, and then here's the other lot of pacifiers. I really need to modify pacifiers so badly. I plan on doing that soon, but I have to find some more magnets because I had a bunch of magnets, but when I got married, I moved, and my reborning supplies for making dolls um, and like doll craft things are all in storage right now. So I'm just, Waiting to either go search for them or I have to buy more. Probably going to have to buy more because it's just going to take too long to find them. Alright, so we have this one. has a guitar and it says... Rock and Roll, I think. It's really small. Not a big fan of that one either, so... Quite a few of these will probably be going to some friends. I might even do a pacifier giveaway. Who knows? This one is really cute. This is one of the pacifiers that really caught my eye in that lot. It has a little elephant and a cloud and little stars. Super adorable. Then we have this one. It has I think it's little birds hatching. It's very tiny too, so it's hard to see. And then this one, which is just a plain one. I'm not going to bring it up to the camera because it's just a solid colored pacifier. And then these two, I believe, are um, vintage pacifiers. Again, with this camera. There we go. Um, this one. Oh, this one has a magnet already. Alright. There are those. And then we have this one, which I believe is supposed to be a glow-in-the-dark pacifier. Let's see. It's glowing a little bit, but you can't. I think so. Yeah, it's glowing a little bit, but you can't really see it on camera, I don't think. All right, I'm gonna turn the light back on. And then 
this one which says Rockstar and it has camo. And this one. This one also really caught my eye. Thought it was really cute. Yes, so I got all these sapphires uh, for a crazy deal. Yeah, this video turned out to be a lot longer than I expected it to be. I cannot wait to share the babies that are coming soon with you all. And also, I've been talking about my Marcus by A.K. Kitagawa for a really long time. And finally, she is going to be started soon. Um, I'm really excited to see how she turns out. Her artist is going to do an amazing job on her like she always does on my babies. Anyway... I need to go make dinner now, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching, everyone.